Space. Welcome to another FIFA 17 video where today, as you may have seen in my awesome intro, we are doing Team of the Season predictions with the best players in the world. If you do not know, Team of the Season is basically highlighting all the players that have done really well in their leagues and giving them special cards that are really high rated and awesome. So, I am doing the top three leagues, at least in my opinion, which are the Bundesliga, the Premier League, and the La Liga, or like the Spanish League. So, let's get on with it. Alright, here are my predictions for the first team of the season, which is the Bundesliga. For strikers, I have Timo Werner, Robert Lewandowski, and Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. I think they've all been stand out, and they're very good strikers, so I think they're gonna get in. Next in the midfield is Emil Forsberg, Nabi Keita, and Alshmay Dembele. They, not all of them are midfielders, aka Dembele, but I think they've all been good playmakers, crossing and some scoring, and I think they all deserve team of the season. Next in defense is Jonas Hector, Socrates, Mats Hummels, and Philip Lahm. For me, Hector like the wing back roles were the hardest to choose because I mean sorry full back roles because they weren't very many standout full backs. I chose these two because honestly I think they're the best ones in the league so I hope they get the team of the season. Socrates and Matt Hummels both have had multiple informs and I think both of them have been very good for their clubs and deserve the team of the season. And then for goalie, there were three options that I was exploring. Bern Leno, Jan Sommer, and Rune Alming Jarstein. I chose Jarstein because his team, Hertha Berlin, is probably going to finish third in the league. Higher than both Leverkusen, which is Leno's team, and um, Manchin Gladbach, which is Sommer's team. So that's why I chose him. Next is the Premier League team of the season. Who will be in the team of the season? Let's find out. Alright, so, first of all, we have Eden Hazard, Zlatan Ibrahimovic, aka God, and Sadio Mane. For Ibrahimovic, I think you can understand, switching from clubs and scoring plenty of goals is deserving of a team of the season. Sadio Mane was injured for a while ago, like maybe a month ago, and he's out for the rest of the season. But what he did during the season, I think deserves a team of the season. And then, Eden Hazard and Chelsea are probably going to win the league sadly, and I think he played a very big role in it, so I think he'll be in team of the season. Then, in midfield is Hyung Min Son, Dele Alli, and Felipe Coutinho. Coutinho has arguably been the best player for Liverpool this season, so I think he should get in, because Liverpool are one of the top clubs. And then Dele Alli and Hyung Min Son have both been great for Spurs, scoring goals and getting assists. So I think they're going to be a major role in how like Spurs is maybe going to get second or third. And then in the defense is Marcus Alonso, David Luiz, Mustafi, and Bellerin, Hector Bellerin. So Alonso has been quite good for Chelsea in the last third or half of the season. And so I think he's going to be the best left back in the Premier League or left wing back because I couldn't really find anyone else. Then, David Luiz for Chelsea has been very good, even though he switched from Paris Saint-Germain, just like Ibrahimovic. And then, Shkodran Mustafi is honestly the, one of the best centre-backs in the Premier League. I think he deserves the win, I mean, the team of the season. Bellerin has also been great for Arsenal, quite quick and just defending well. And then, Kasper Schmeichel, I know he probably won't get in, but I feel like he's been the best in the Premier League, because he's kept Leicester in the Premier League, even though they're, like, 
performance hasn't been that great, and he's had multiple informs in both the Champions League and the Premier League, so I think he deserves to get it, even though he probably won't. Finally, is the La Liga Santander Tots. Let's find out which one they are. Alright, so Messi, Ronaldo, and Neymar. Honestly, I don't think anyone could argue with me that they are going to get into the team of the season. They're just so good that you can't deny it. I've put Messi and Ronaldo at 99, even though I think Messi should get the 99, because I honestly don't know which one will get the 99. Anyways, next is the midfield, which is consists of Tony Cruz, Isco, and Andres Iniesta. I feel like those three have performed quite well during the season. I mean, I could switch Cruz with Modric. Either of them probably are pretty good. But Isco scored many goals and got like three informs. And I feel Iniesta has been quite, like, um, consistent for Barcelona. And then Marcelo, Ramos, Sergi Ramos, Gerard Pica, and Sergi Roberto make up the defense. Marcelo, arguably the best left back in the league for now. I think he should get it. And then Sergi Ramos and Pique, equally for Barcelona and Real Madrid, have been a stone at the back of the defense. Then Sergi Roberto for... Barcelona has been quite good running up the wings and scoring that last goal in the Champions League. And then Jan Oblak for Atletico Madrid has been a very good goalie, and I think he deserves it. Anyways, guys, that brings us to the end of our video. You are watching FIFA Time. Remember to like and subscribe. Comment down below if you have any other suggestions, and I will see you next time.